The Genius Invocation Game Night Boys. Colleagues, fellow steamed alumni of the academia, heroes of Sumeru, bestest of friends. Almost even as popular as Venti's emo band of animal boys among the fandom. Now, if you're like me and ever tempted by the succulent appeal of lore compliance and gameplay, you might be thinking about putting these fine fellows on a team together. At the onset, there are some obvious downsides from a gameplay perspective. No healer, no shield, and I'll hate them, Kaveh and Tainari are all dendro, leaving us with exclusively quicken and aggravate reactions from Sino's Electro. No burn, no bloom, and no hyper bloom, which renders Kaveh's elemental skill virtually useless, unless we're fighting a hydro elemental or standing in a puddle. With smart gameplay, food buffs, and a hefty spoonful of patience, it's workable in the overworld. But you've seen the title. We're not here for average gameplay. We're here to see how well these boys work together when thrown into a raw test of skill. That's right, folks. Today, we're throwing the Sumeru Game Night Boys into the Spiral Abyss. To give them the best chance, I did make some adjustments to my character builds. I use Alhatham on a regular basis, so the only modification was stealing my Ayaka's Iron Sting for his sword. We have a two-piece Deepwood Memories and a two-piece Wanderer's Troop Artifact set for those Dendro and Elemental buffs to beef up his ult. All talents are at level 7. Kave has arguably his best weapon, both practically and aesthetically, the mailed flower from this year's Windbloom event. He's equipped with a four-piece Flower of Paradise Lost for that Elemental Mastery boost and Dendro reaction buffs. He's our only character with Constellation since he's a 4-star and I'm poor. Elemental skill and burst talents are at 7, and basic attack is at 6. We're working on it. He's new. For Tainari, we have the Sacrificial Bow to speed up that energy recharge. He's decked out with a 2-piece Instructor and a 2-piece Deepwood Memories for Elemental Mastery and Dendro damage, since, as you saw with his weapon, we're going to be leaning into that elemental skill. I stole a bunch of artifacts from my other characters to give him because I don't actually use him much these days. He's sitting at level 7 skill and burst with level 6 basic attack. And finally, Sino. We have him with a prototype star glitter for that sweet, sweet attack boost and energy recharge. Two piece Wanderer's Troop and two piece Nobly Sublige for that elemental burst damage. And like Tainari and Kaveh, level 7 skill and burst talents with level 6 basic attack. We'll be starting with floor 1. Ugh, it's been a while since I've been here. Pyro damage dealt by all party members increased by 75%. Well, that would be great if we had any pyro. Oh no, oh no! Electro. Uh, it's okay, it's okay. Sino can stand down on this round. Our dendro boys got us. Yeah, piece of cake. Hilly Churl's gonna get wrecked. Let's nip that in the butt. The lack of animo is tricky for crowd control, but we're doing okay so far. Oh, not Electro again! Oh, damn. Gave made quick work of her. Alright, floor one, smooth sailing. On to floor two. Cryo damage dealt by all party members increased by 75%. Hmm. Cryo, huh? So we're gonna go with, yeah, dendro, 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 electro. Looks good. Not the electro slimes again. <laughs> Oh, yes! Oh, yes, 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 yes! Water! The floor is water! Oh, <laughs> Kave Dendro Cores, here we go! Why, thank you for the hydro. Kave extends his thanks and his blade. Floor three, let's go! Increases swirl damage by 300% and its AoE by 100%. Kazuha. Venti, Jean, sitting right there, tempting me. But no, no animo for us today. Sumeru game night boys only. Let's go. <laughs> All right, Pyro, we can work with that. Burn, 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 baby. Treasure hoarder. All right, we're taking a little damage now due to those elemental reactions, but nothing we can't handle. Oh, hello. Easy peasy. If there's one thing this team was made for, it's fighting ruined guards. Yup, look at it go down. 
Well, 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 folks, would you look at what a beautiful gift Floor 4 has for us? Electro damage increased by 75%. Electro damage buffs. Sino, get ready to be the real MVP. And Hydro? Dendro Cores, let's go! I would like to personally give Spiral Abyss Floor 4 a kiss on the mouth. Look at those cores burst! Kave, you're doing great, sweetie. More Hydro? Don't mind if I do. After a floor sweeping win like that, nothing could possibly bring me down. Oh. Oh no. Uh. So floor five is where we split up the team, huh? Alright, what are we fighting? Cryo in the first half, Pyro in the second. Okay, we'll need Electro for the Cryo, so Tynar and Sino, you take the first half. I'll hate them and Kave the second. Okay, Sino's ult is carrying us so far. We're taking more damage than I'd like on Chamber 1, considering our lack of shields and healers, but we got it done. Okay, I'll hate them. Kave, you're up. Oh, not the Pyro Mages. Oh no, oh no, 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 no! Not the burn damage! Oh god. Oh. Ouch, 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 ouch! Okay. Okay, we made it. Whew. We're going to go with an elemental burst cooldown buff for this floor because Sino and Alhatham's bursts are really carrying us. Oh no. Not the stamina drains. Okay, okay, okay. Sino's Electro is getting us through this so far, but health isn't looking so good. Not the Pyro! Not the burn damage! No, 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 no! Okay, alright. Okay, Kave. Okay, Kave, you got this! No! He didn't got this. Okay, uh... So, floor five, huh? Let's try again. Maybe if we dodge those pyro attacks, we can... So many things over I never accomplished. I don't miss gosh my dreams. All right, then. Um, on to floor six. Uh, I'm not finished by a new cycle. Chicken. Floor seven? Oh, no, no, no. Any more oh, time. We're, we're dead. We're, we're dead. Okay, floors 5 through 7 are a no-go. I tried again with artifact modifications to buff up everyone's damage, stole my Venti's stringless bow for Tainari, and added some pyro resistance. but... I think it's safe to say this isn't a team you want to be taking with you to fight the pyro hypostasis. To test this team on the deeper floors, I also took them through floor 8, which went surprisingly well, and while we managed to clear floor 9, we didn't get enough stars to proceed on to floor 10. I think a lot of this can be attributed to the current version of the deeper floors being designed with Dendro in mind. The default 8 were designed before Dendro entered the game, and our team, uh, it's all Dendro, baby. Conclusion? This isn't a team to be taking into the Spiral Abyss, unless it's floor 4. They may not have synergy as a team, but they're still the best of friends. Out for dinner together after a long day toiling in the Abyss. Add Astra Abyssos, my friends. Wait. Where's my key? 